Yo, um, what are your thoughts on, uh, on on your Pistons right now, man? Man, I'm not even going to lie, bro. I don't even watch sports. Not for real. I know the season's about to start. I love all the Detroit teams just because they from that way, but I don't watch that shit, bro. I don't, I don't watch sports at all. To be fair, you, you haven't had a reason to watch the Pistons for <laughs> like 20 years. <laughs> I ain't going to lie. I do feel like the Lions going to win the Super Bowl this year. I just feel that shit. I don't know why. Boy, the Lions are good. I think them boys really going to win. I just It just seemed like I feel it. I smell that shit in the air. It's happening. For yeah. So, remember I said that them boys going to take that bitch. Yo, it's crazy, too, because, like, I went to a, a – when we're in Detroit, I didn't realize. I found out Little Caesar started in Detroit. You talking about the pizza spot? Yeah, I didn't know yeah. that was started in Detroit. I had no I fucking idea. That. I didn't know because I was like, "Yo, oh, it's the Little Caesars Arena." Yeah. And they're like, "Yeah, it started here." I'm like, "Oh, that makes sense because they used to be popping with the square I pizzas." It, uh, what's Holmes? He was a black dude. Levan Hawkins. That's 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 how you remember. Is that his name? Yeah, Levan Hawkins. Hawkins. He had a run with the Little Caesars. Listen, there's been run. nothing more clutch in. Uh, the life of a, a up and coming struggling radio personality as myself when I was a kid and a five dollar pizza. What you mean struggling? You saying back then? Back then, yeah. That fuck used to survive. My, sure. my son was off that little season. That's Caesar's, that dog. trap house special. That's that one bitch. That's <laughs> yeah. that yeah. Nigga feed a whole family. That hot with, and ready. Hot and ready. That shit, man. Um, so, ha, 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 like you said, you got a bunch of big features that you're just sitting on that are going to be for the next project. So, like now that you're independent, obviously you could just do what the fuck you want. Yeah. New That's albums dropping part. in October. Mm -hmm. I'm assuming we're not going to have to wait much longer for... No, I'm going to drop that bitch ASAP just so I can hurry up and push the other album up. Mm. Yeah. Would you do a joint project with anybody? Yeah, I would. Yeah, I would. I feel like there's been some good ones coming out of out of the city, obviously. For sure. The, the T Grizzly Skiller Baby album was hard that, as fuck. Yeah, that bitch was stupid. That's the album that the one song they had on Perfect, right? Mm -hmm. What's the name of the song? I think you got gorgeous, it. Right. Gorgeous, gorgeous. Gorgeous. That's, yeah, it's gorgeous. That yeah. bitch was a hit. I do a joint album. I just don't know who. Don't who would you want to do a joint album with? I don't know, bro. I mean, you're on tour with Peasy right now. Yeah, that's my brother. Though. That's my twin. Both that's, you guys are like, independent. Yeah, Peasy, Peasy, his a uh, his a uh, his a uh, feature partner is Payroll. That boys got a lot of shit together. They do. Boys are good. That's a good duo. That's a great duo. They but y'all are a good duo too. Y'all on the road together. Peasy, my twin though. I'm. A, I I think I want to do some shit with somebody like that. I don't like. That I rarely do music with, you know what I'm saying? Right. To make it make sense. What about sense. somebody from Flint? I do it with, I do it like Crispy Life, RMC Mike's Mike, hard, Rio, yeah, all them niggas Flint hard, they all yeah, fun. yeah, that'll be hard. Yeah, I feel like I feel like that's kind of like been the the thing in Detroit is like these collab projects popping up and they've yeah. all, they've all delivered for sure. So for you, like you're not uh, like, would you say you're not gonna entertain a, a label situation ever again? Because at this point, you're you fucking paper right, absolutely. It's got to be something you can't. Shit, something crazy. Yeah. Something I go spin on the youngins. It got to be about them. You know what I'm saying? Again, like right now, I wouldn't waste nobody's time. But if it if it's a sweet situation, then if it's something that's about more so about other people and not myself, fuck yeah, like a label deal with some with a real check, like involved. a real infrastructure, a real yeah. bag where you could put some money. So I can hire a real yeah. team and a full team. And really sit back and put my mind to work and focus on other people more. You know what I mean? I just want to get. I just want a lot of a lot of more money and just sit back and spend my shit quietly, bro. I like. I, I don't. I like being low. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. I ain't no party nigga. I don't go out. I don't hang out. I don't be with no. I don't hang with nobody. You know what I'm saying? I got a lot of homies. I got a lot of family. I got a lot. Of, I got a lot of youngins. But I'm a nigga that just be dolo all day, every day, until I feel like popping out. Yeah. It's on the flow. You know what I'm saying? 